My God. Liz is your sister? Man, this is news. You didn't know, Coach? I had no idea. Listen, Whitney, uh, if there's anything at all I can do, just... No, no, Fox, just leave me alone, okay? Why do I scare you so much, Whitney? Is it because somewhere in your heart you know you love me as much as I love you? Eve, is it true? Is Liz really your sister? Yes, it's true. You're really my aunt? Liz, what the hell is going on here? This can't be true. It's true, TC. You know, Eve's mama must have married a second time after my brother. This must be the second husband's kid. Good. It's about time someone made you squirm, Liz. How come you didn't say anything? Because she hates me, TC. Liz is responsible for all of this. For my past being exposed in this way. She came to Harmony to get revenge on me and to destroy my family. I admit I made mistakes in my past, but I never set out to hurt anyone. Unlike my sister, who came to Harmony with just one goal. It was to ruin my life. TC, I know that I should have told you the truth. I should have told all of you. God knows I wanted to. I certainly didn't want it to come out like this with Liz exposing my past in the worst possible way. No, Eve, don't try to blame Liz. Because of Liz, I know the whole truth about you. And why do you think that is, TC? Why do you think that Liz waited so long to tell? Well, I will tell you why. Because it's all part of her plan. Ask her. Ask her why she had to get Aunt Irma to bring the truth out. No, no, wait, no, don't, because she's just gonna lie again. I will tell you why. Because she had to keep herself out of it. Because she had to make sure that you found out the truth without her actually being the one to tell you. It was all part of her plan. What the hell are you talking about? What plan? The plan to replace me in my children's hearts, and in my husband's bed. What, what? Think about it, TC. Think about the way that she wormed herself into our family, just wormed herself into our life, and especially into your life. Liz, is this true? Is that why you came here to live? Is that why you exposed Eve's past? Because of some well-plotted out plan? Listen, I, I know you're mad at me because I never told you how Look, I felt about now, you. Look, not now, Fox. Please, excuse me. Liz, is it true? Did you come to my house as a part of some plan? Answer me, Liz. Is it true? Are you Eve's sister? And if you are, why the hell did you tell anybody? I can't believe you're our aunt and you never said so. Why didn't you say anything, Liz? Will your lies never stop? Are you lying about Liz just like you lied about everything else? <sighs> Not the one lying here, TC. You, you gonna deny that you are my sister? It's true, Eve. I am your little sister. What's that witch up to now? So why don't you just admit the rest of it? You are my sister. You came to Harmony to get revenge on me and to ruin my life. Eve's telling the truth. Liz has been blackmailing her since she came to Harmony. Nobody asked you to say a word. If I had another word out of you, I'm going to shut you up. Hey, 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 hey,
so you can straighten this mess out. I didn't come here to hurt you, Eve. I certainly didn't try to take your family away from you. Oh, God, you are such a liar. Yes. I was angry when I first came here. All I could think about was the past. But when I saw the wonderful life you had, I just wanted to reach out to you somehow. Somehow be a part of your family in some small way. You know that is the most outrageous lie. How many times did I beg you to forgive me so that we could be family again? Eve, what did you want Liz to forgive you for? Remember when I told you about my sister who abandoned me? Left me to be abused by my father night after night after night. Wait a minute. You're that sister? Yes. Eve is a sister who abandoned me. And yes, I wanted revenge at first. Even after everything you did to me, Eve, I could never hurt you. I would never ruin my own sister's life, even though you ruined mine. Liz, why didn't you tell us that you were Eve's sister? Everyone had already heard the story about what my sister did to me, and I... I didn't want to identify Eve as that sister because then everyone would look down on her. And I certainly didn't want everyone to know about your past, your sordid life. How are you going to stand there and tell that lie? That's exactly the reason that you brought Aunt Irma here. Or else, why else did you go to such great lengths to get her here, to meet T.C.? No, no, Eve. I only wanted to reunite you so that Whitney and Simone could meet their great aunt. You never thought anything about my girls. All you thought about was how you could bring some poor old woman here and try and ruin my life. Old. Leave Liz alone. You can't blame Liz for what you've done. At least she didn't lie to us like you did. Oh, God. Are you believing this? Can you believe this? Can't you see that this is all part of an elaborate plan to destroy me in your eyes using my aunt? I had no idea what Aunt Irma was going to say. And as for me not telling your family about your past, what did you want me to do, Eve? Call a family meeting? Tell them all that you were a drunk and a drug addict and that you sang in dives and had different men in your bed every night. Stop. That you had Julian Crane's bastard child. What? You accuse me of lying. But doesn't it all boil down to the fact that you were the one who really lied about your past? That you were a slut and a tramp. Shut up, Liz. No, you shut up. Oh, no, 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 you're forgetting something, Liz. Not only is Mom a slut and a tramp, but she is also a hypocrite. Well, isn't that right, Mother? Aren't you just a hypocrite? I'm so sorry. You're sorry? No. Sorry isn't going to cut it, Mom. All my life, growing up in this house, all Daddy ever talked about was what a wonderful mother you are. So honest, so moral, so perfect. And don't forget role model. Some role model. And of course, Daddy, I don't blame you. I mean, you had absolutely no idea what she was really like. I mean, she managed to deceive you with her upstanding, righteous image, too. But what I can't stop thinking about is how you used to get on me and Simone about being so proper, you know? <laughs> Always doing and saying the right things, being such ladies, like singing. You didn't let us sing. <laughs> you forbid me and Simone to sing, even though I really wanted a singing career. But it was okay for you to sing, right? It was okay for you to sing in sleazy clubs, to get hooked on drugs, to sleep with, to have an illegitimate child. 
Don't you know I was just trying to protect you? Well, what did you think, Mom? Oh, did you think I was going to be like you? I couldn't be like you in a million years. I can never deceive the people that I love. I can never lie to them face to face every single day. Pretend to be something that I'm not. I can never hurt Daddy the way you did. And you know what, Mom? For that, I will never forgive you. Do you understand me? I will never forgive you. This is about as exciting as watching paint dry. I'm hungry. Y'all got anything to eat? Well, I'll be in the kitchen. Call me if something exciting happens. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Sam, I feel so bad for all of them. Yeah, me too. Oh, Julian. They hate me. They all hate me. <laughs> I never thought that I would see the day that my wife would be in the arms of Julian Cray. Look at your daughters, Eve. Look how much they despise you. Your marriage and our family has been destroyed by your lies. <laughs>